In this video, I'm going to tell you why chemical engineers are the most important people in the scientific community. Pillars of our society, helping to shape the present and the future. For example, without chemical engineers, we wouldn't have the harbour bosch process that has helped to produce ammonia-based fertilisers, helping to feed the whole world. Actually, it's really chemistry that provides all scientific knowledge for real-world solutions. Things like devising a way to chemically alter the mRNA molecule, contributing significantly to the development of a revolutionary vaccine that saved millions of lives across the world from COVID-19. And who was the key to scaling up the laboratory trials in order that the millions of vaccines you talk about have such a global reach? Yes, that's right, chemical engineers. Without chemical engineers creating and optimising the processes that enable the safe mass production at high efficiency and cost effectiveness, your fancy inventions would simply die in the lab. Is that what a chemical engineer does? Always thought you called yourselves engineers to sound more edgy. Chemistry is all about innovation. It's all about finding new, greener ways to do the things we need to do like the chemistry for new batteries for electric vehicles or adapting polymers to make them more recyclable. Or here, designing new, cheaper catalysts based on iron rather than heavy metals like palladium to reduce energy use. But it's chemical engineers that take that innovation and apply it in the practical world. For example, it's us chemical engineers looking at the whole practical process that evaluates the full life cycle impact of these new technologies that helps us to choose the best possible solutions. This will help us to create a full circular economy whereby more materials than ever can be easily recycled. Hmm. But we chemists measure the fundamental properties of molecules and the energetics of reactions and generate the data that you need to develop your practical processes. Like here in the lab, we can analyze the success of the synthesis of our new catalyst using NMR spectroscopy. Well, I suppose I can't deny that you chemists do help us chemical engineers to develop our brand new shiny processes. And I guess I am glad that we have you engineers to get our technologies off the ground and give them the impact that they deserve. Exactly. So let's just agree that we both play a key role in society. Okay. But chemical engineers are edgier.